How to edit reels in DaVinci Resolve After having your footage into your media pool, you want to drag it and leave it onto your timeline. That will create you a timeline node into your master media pool. You want to select that timeline with right click, select timelines and then go to timeline settings. Once you are in that panel, you want to uncheck this box which says use project settings. Then you can go to use vertical resolution and make sure that box is checked. That way your HD resolution will be switched to a vertical one. Next step is going to output right here and you want to go down and select mismatch resolution. Select the drop down menu and select scale full frame with corp. Then go back to format and make sure mismatch resolution is also scale full frame with corp. When you're done, you can select OK. Now your footage will be vertical, 1080 to 1920. As I played through, you can see a preview of the footage that I'm having. If you want to adjust something on the video, you can highlight it, go to the inspector and adjust the zoom and position XY on the video. That way you're making sure that you're not missing anything from the video that you're having. And after finishing editing your video, you can go to deliver tab right here. Select custom export on the top left. On the top box, you can set up your file name. Below that, you can select browse to select your location for the export. Make sure your format is set it on QuickTime and your codec is on H.264. Resolution should be on custom and the values should be 1080 to 1920. Also, the check mark should be on use vertical resolution. Your frame rate should be all based on your footage frame rate. And the quality, you can restrict it 2000 times your frame rate, which in my case is approximately 50,000. Also in here, make sure the entire timeline is selected, select add to render queue and then render all. I also recommend you watching this video right here, I'm pretty sure you're gonna like it. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.